Hi, it's Nika from Fabulously Creative. I am so excited to be back with another DIY slash planner hack slash tutorial. In this video, I am making a loaded pocket. You can use this for Happy Mail, you can use it in scrapbooking, but I will be making mine to sit in my planner. So to get started, all you need is pull one of the pages out of your planner and just trace that to make the main size for your pocket. And this works for any size planner. I just happen to be using uh, my Happy Nietzsche or Happy Notes. I'm not sure what you call it, but it's the new Happy Planner and it measures like four, four by nine inches. And since I have switched back to this planner, I have just been so inspired to make things. So I am making just this little pocket to go in the front just to hold all of my little planner goodies. So the first thing you need to do, just trace a page out of your planner. And I use like a 12 inch paper. So the part, that little leftover piece can be one pocket and then for your other pocket, you can just eyeball it. You just wanna make sure it is kind of like a mid-size in between these two pockets. And there are no exact measurements for this. You can kind of eyeball this depending on the size of your planner. You can uh, use this as the, like the size of your planner or if you have an envelope you wanna use for Happy Mail, you can go by the size of your envelope. And all I'm doing is cutting my three little pieces. And then I will glue them together and punch them with my Happy Planner Punch. Depending on the size of your planner, you can, uh, like you may need like a three hole punch or any, any type of punch. And I am just gluing this with my favorite glue. This is the Scotch Craft glue. I get this at Walmart. Since I have found this glue, I, I don't know, this, it just works perfectly. It works better than tacky glue. And the way I use this glue, when I first buy it, I leave the top off overnight just so it can get super tacky. And after that, it is just perfect and good to go. I used to didn't like using wet glue at all because I don't know, I just made so much of a mess, but the glue tape was getting kind of expensive. So I have this all glued together and I'm just gonna go ahead and punch it. And I am just eyeballing like the center. And you always have to be careful with your happy punch because it does not punch that many pages. So I kind of get it in there before I snap it down. And now I am just making sure it fits. I do go and trim the bottom just so it sits in my planner nicely. And yes, I do have a video on my little planner setup of how I set this planner up and what is in the inside. So I will link that in, this, in the description along with the other little planner goodies that I made for this planner. And I am just showing you how uh, this fits perfectly into a mailing envelope if you're using this size planner. So this is a nice quick little project to mail, you know, some happy mail to send to your friends or just pop it in your planner to hold your goodies. And from here, it's pretty, well, I'll, I will add one more pocket. But from here, it is pretty much done. So the rest is just decorating and seeing what little, what little planner stickers and what goodies you wanna stuff in there.
I am adding a little vellum pocket on front of that top pocket just because I had lots of little die cuts and embellishments and I wanted them to be visible so you can see what is inside the pocket. So this step is optional, but it does give, I don't know, just a little extra to your project. And I am making this pocket, I'm adding, um, some red line glue tape you can use regular glue but just be careful using regular glue with vellum because it does like it does wrinkle wrinkle the vellum and it doesn't dry flat and i am put placing my scissors in the inside before i press it down just so it dries with that little with a little extra flap to stick things in. Now this next step is totally optional. I am, this is not, I'm just gonna say this is not a shaker pocket, but I am, am gonna add a little sequence because they were on my desk and I thought it would be pretty. So this is not for everyone because these little sequins will not be sealed in here in any kind of way. So when you open, open your planner, a few may pop out, but that doesn't bother me. I like a little sparkle popping out on me so I have those in there and now I am just going to fill just fill the pocket with little embellishments and little goodies
hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss my new videos.